any advice how to make the most of learning experiences standing out in the first few rough months? Okay, yeah, I uh, I totally feel, Ian, I feel you. Um, my first few months in corporate finance sucked. They were very rough. So um, I guess I should have talked about, about that a little bit more. So I kind of came in uh, from a startup where I did everything. And it, it was a little ambiguous. Things were ambiguous, but um, I was never in a big corporate environment. So I could just go to the straight to the CEO and just talk to him. I could go to my clients and kind of ask clarifying questions. Uh, when I was in my start of corporate finance, my first month I was on the, on the bench, kind of like if you, any of you guys work in consulting or anything, you basically are doing nothing. So I was like on Netflix all month. Uh, <laughs> but um, yeah, I mean, I really didn't know what to make of it because I just thought that it's a big company. They'll give me what to, what I need to do. And so they really didn't didn't do that. The person that I, I took over for left in like two weeks and she was, kind of tra she was uh, training me remotely. So it was really difficult to pick up the, the thing. So uh, I guess the first, my best advice would be I mean, really is to get get your feet wet, get deep in there, try to shadow someone, uh, try to get a mentor early. And it doesn't have to be like a director or manager. It can just be another analyst that works close to you. I think that's once you build that, that really, really helped me uh, because I was too I was too scared to ask questions. I was kind of like by myself when they, they put me like in an aisle like all by myself. So I was really far away from my team anyway. Um, I thought I think that one, one thing to do is just find someone you can ask questions that you can, you're comfortable approaching and kind of kick it with them and be friends with them. And they are extremely, extremely helpful because yeah, I mean, you can have those, like, you, you have those technical skills, you, you learn Excel, you learn like macros, but those don't, those don't matter yet in the first few months. Uh, the first few months is all about understanding your current job, your current rotation. So yeah, I definitely feel you, Ian. Uh, it's a great question. Try to try to build a mentor. I think it's the number one thing to do to be successful, uh, build a mentor or two where you can just kind of run through questions. Uh, and again, because you're you're there for the first few months, uh, there's no such thing as a stupid question yet. Uh, just try not to ask the same thing twice. Take good notes. Um, but yeah, just keep asking. And if, if for example, like you, uh, the first person you went to, you had a question about, uh, they they answered it, and then you forgot it, and then you have like a very similar situation, but you don't want to ask that person. Ask another person. You know, just kind of be a little tactical about it. Try not to ask the same question twice to the same person, but you can ask it to different people as long as they don't know, right? <laughs>